Most couples who are saving for a big down payment to buy a home, they are already making their mortgage payment. They just don't realize it yet. So I had a couple reach out to me, men, we want to buy a $700,000 home. We have 5% down, but our parents told us to wait till we have 20%. What should we do? I asked them, how much are you saving? We're paying about $3,500 a month of rent and we're saving about $2,000 a month. First of all, I'm like, the fact that you can save 2,000 bucks a month, you're a champion in my book. So if they're paying $3,500 a month for rent and they're saving two grand a month, that's about 5,500. Let's say you bought your home right now. If you bought your home right now and you put 5% down, your mortgage payment is 5,400. And you're already making that payment. You just didn't realize it. They're like, oh my gosh. But let's say you don't buy right now. Let's say you want to save your 2,000 bucks a month till you have 20% down. It would take you four years to save the rest of the down payment. But people always forget about inflation and appreciation. Let's fast forward four years from now. On a $700,000 home with 3% appreciation every year, on an average, four years later, your home is worth 788,000. So you'd have to save even a bigger down payment. But let's say you have it. You put 20% down, your loan amount's gonna be 650,000. And your mortgage payment is about $5,100 a month. But let's say you bought four years ago. Four years later, your home is worth 788. Your balance though is 633,000. And with the PMI falling off, your payment's about 5,100. So your payment is about the same, but you're gonna have more equity if you bought today instead of waiting four years later and coming out of pocket with even a bigger down payment. So once they saw that, they're like, this is a no brainer. So they're gonna buy now instead of waiting.